We've all had moments where we thought we achieved the impossible, but sadly, most of us just didn't have a camera rolling at the right time. Thankfully, these people were lucky enough to be caught in the action, demonstrating how sometimes the impossible is possible. Let's get it on! <laughs> Some people are able to make something as simple as drinking water into a true work of art. These guys have mastered the skill of speed drinking in ways none of us could have ever imagined. Just like that. Don't think that's impressive? Just watch them drink an entire bottle of water in just a second. As cool as it looks though, maybe just leave it to the pros. Some people can turn just about anything into something amazing. All these guys had was a water bottle and a frisbee, but they didn't care. They wanted to put on a show, and they did just that. Oh! I've seen many water bottle flips along the years, but nothing even comes close to that. All athletes have a choice. You can either do your sport the normal way, or you can attempt something impossible. This man not only tried out water skiing without any skis, but he decided he'd take it further. Good thing someone recorded it all because nobody would have believed he'd done it. We can all relate to the stresses from a typical game of Jenga, but it's not just a test of physical skill. There's a strategy to it too. This is about as high risk as you can get. Really, there's almost no chance he'll survive this move. And yet somehow, everything remained upright. I think we have a ninja in the making. Some pastimes have a little more at stake than others, but the people who enjoy dangerous sports also enjoy a tricky stunt or two. And that's great, because we get to witness moments like this. Most of us wouldn't be able to safely land from a paraglider at all. We definitely couldn't land this perfectly with one. If you play football, you know that one of the most satisfying types of goals is when you get the ball straight through the legs of your opponent. Takafusa Kubo experienced one of the greatest ever versions of that. You'd think there was no way he'd be able to score from that position. Well, hold that thought for a second. And like magic, the ball whizzed between the legs of four players for one of the most spectacular goals ever. People have tried so many ways to land trick shots in basketball, but this one seems to be particularly ambitious. You'd think there was no way to land that shot from a helicopter, but these guys decided to give it a go anyways from 200 feet in the air. Incredibly, they nailed the shot. They'll be telling people about this for years, and I don't blame them. Most of us wouldn't walk blindfolded even if someone paid us. Now imagine doing it downstairs and with someone balancing on your head. But if you think that's impressive, just wait. They can literally do it backwards as well. Nice. It's a nerve-wracking stunt to watch, but they seem to perform it perfectly. They definitely deserve a world record for such an achievement. There are probably countless ways to open a bottle, but there aren't many that are quite as cool as this. Even great cyclists would have a hard time replicating that. How many times can you spin around before you start getting dizzy? Now try landing a basketball shot. Or better yet, you could try doing it like this guy. This is the mother of all trick shots. He bounces the ball off the roof, does a 1080 degree spin, and then manages to get the ball into the basket with his butt. I don't know how, but I could watch it forever. It's hard enough to fly a plane in the air where it belongs, let alone doing it like this. These tunnels were clearly designed for cars, but Dario Costa was confident he could fly his plane through them at 152 miles per hour, and he did just that. I don't know about you, but the sides of the tunnels seemed dangerously close to the wings of the plane. Thankfully, he completed the stunt without error and landed himself a new Guinness World Record, literally. Even in something repetitive like live sports, what the hell? some things just leave you scratching your head for a while. You'll have to watch this moment more than once before you believe it really happened. It was just your average foul ball, right up until the ball disappeared and reappeared inside the umpire's pocket, like an old-fashioned magic trick. But this was no magic trick, he just got really, really lucky. Contreras. Strike one. All sports have their difficulties, but it's also true that they become even more difficult if you play them backwards. For example, if you tried to play golf backwards, you're at a serious disadvantage because you can't see the cup. But difficult apparently doesn't mean impossible. That really is an incredible shot. Accidents happen, that's just an unavoidable fact of life, but it's how you handle them that counts. Of course, some accidents are worse than others, like this man who lost a ski while in mid-air. That's definitely not the ideal moment for that to happen, but against all odds, he managed to turn his misfortune into an incredible stunt.
The most exciting moments in tennis often happen in the middle of a fast-paced rally. Kevas could have just let this ball go, but instead, he finished it off with an unbelievable no-look passing shot, and what an incredible shot it was. To achieve something great, you have to attempt something that nobody has ever done before. Two-time Olympian Christian Haller set out to beat a world record and defy the odds. He set the record for the highest snowboard air on a hip jump, clocking in at an incredible height of 37 feet over the coping. I can only imagine the looks on his competitors' faces. If there's one thing that always impresses people, it's anything involving a samurai sword. But even though most people can mindlessly swing one through the air, very few people can actually do something with it. These balls are traveling at a speed of over 99 miles per hour. Most of us couldn't even catch one, let alone cut one in half mid-flight with a sword. Everyone loves the suspense of a photo finish, but you've never seen one like this before. These competitors were so evenly matched that three of them ended in a photo finish for second place, but none of them were actually on their feet at the time. They all slid over the line at seemingly the exact same moment, while the one who stayed up took the win. There's more than one way to ride a bike. But I'll bet you haven't seen this one before. A wheelie is an everyday kind of trick, but a wheelie on the front wheel is a whole new level of difficulty. That's a skill that would take some time to match. Most things get less exciting the more you see them, but football goals just aren't one of them. Even the simplest of goals get cheers from the crowd, so imagine how thrilled everyone was to witness this. Cissé has gone for it. The odds were against Cissé in every way, and yet somehow it went straight in. There was no way the goalkeeper was saving that. We've all felt like pros before when winning a game of pool, but Florian Kohler is here to make you feel like the absolute amateur you are. This is his incredible Guinness World Record attempt, and it will take your breath away. And he did it all in under 8 seconds. Golf isn't the best sport to practice in your backyard. There just isn't the right kind of space. You could play it like these guys. It's not quite golf as you know it, but it might be even more fun to watch. Just look at that shot through his opponent's legs and a perfect arc over his body before going straight in for a hole-in-one. You won't often have the chance to throw a TV screen off of a balcony, but even if you did get the opportunity, you won't be able to top the way these guys did it. Any last words? None. That guy has my respect. Sometimes mistakes actually end up working to your advantage. This kid was certain he'd totally missed his shot. Let's face it, that throw was way off target. But the ball had other ideas. It bounced perfectly off the rails and straight into the basket. He honestly couldn't have landed that shot even if he tried. 